Good evening. Welcome, everybody. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Chris, hello, Jorge. Good evening, hello. mister. Hello, sir, yes, sir. How about your weekend? Ah, it was very good. I had a presentation with my daughter in uh, Escuela de Danza Morena Celarie. It was very nice. How about you, Chris? How was your weekend? Congratulations. Fine. Trying to fix my house. <laughs> uh, only in your house? Hmm. Yeah. Oh, okay, good. Well, at least you were resting, you know, descansando. That's cool. That's yeah. Good. good. Now, let's begin with the class. Okay. Let me copy the listener today. Ana Maria. Josue. And maybe that is in transportation in this moment. Okay, today we have two specific activities, right? Number one, the review. Repaso, right? Review. Uh, of unit number two. Simple present, right? Affirmative, negative, and yes, no question. And also we are going to make the midterm test, the midterm test together, right? And that's it. These are the two activities for today. So let's begin with the presentation. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome sure. to class. Yeah, yeah, tell me. Este, le quería reportar que, fíjese que este, tengo problemas en mi casa con el Wi-Fi mm. y estoy con mi teléfono con, con datos, pero por, okay. si, por si se me traba, o algo es por eso, pero aquí okay. estoy, es presente. Excellent, very good, Saul, but you're, you're going to participate in the class. Yes, yes, I do. Ah, good. Excellent, excellent, very good. And thank you for giving importance to this class. Thank you very much. Sorry. Okay, come on, Claro. Help me. <laughs> okay. Well, we're going to continue with the practice. Uh, daily routines, right? And this is the same practice, right? Talk about daily routines and say what people do and what people don't do, right? Affirmative and negative. Now, this is a reminder. What is the simple present? Is one of the several forms of present tense in English. We use this to describe habits, routines, habitual activities, right? Repeated events and general truth, right? Uh, it's simple. Just use the base form of the verb, I, you, we, they. And then the verb, I take, you take, we take, they take. I run, you run, we run, they run. I eat, you eat, we eat, they eat, etc., etc. And with the third person singular, we have an S at the end of the verb. So we say he takes, she takes, he runs, she runs. My sister eats, my brother eats, etc., cetera, et cetera. Good night, teacher. Good evening, Yancy. Welcome. Welcome to the party. I mean, no, welcome to the class. <laughs> Good evening, teacher. Good Love evening, Marlon. Hello, Mr. Gomez. How are you? It's a pleasure to see you again, Marlon. Okay, thank you. It thank you, me too. Okay, good, thank you. Now let's begin. How do you form the affirmative statements or affirmative sentences with the simple present? Subject, verb, and complement. Subject, verb, and complement. When it's third person singular, instead of saying she made, you say she makes. Subject, verb, and complement. In negative st statement, we use the auxiliary do and does plus the word not. So we say they don't, they don't work, they do not, or they don't work, etc. When it's third person singular, for example, you say my boss does not, 
or doesn't talk about the new rules. So it's subject, auxiliary plus not, the verb and the complement. Subject does not, oh, do not, plus the verb, plus the complement, right? Subject does or do not the verb and the complement. This is the general view. Look, affirmative. Subject, uh, you, we, they, Sylvia, and Candy, Saul, and Yancy, Marlon, and Mario, etc., etc. Make phone calls. When it's third person singular, she, he, it, my friend, uh, Oscar, uh, Dagoberto, Chris, Jorge, makes phone calls, right? My student, my brother, my sister makes. When it's negative, I say, I don't, you don't, we don't, they don't, Sylvia and Candy don't. Saul and Griselda don't, Christian and Jorge don't, don't, right? Then the verb and the complement. When it's third person singular, we say, does not, and the verb, is the base form. We don't say she doesn't makes or he doesn't makes. No, no. She doesn't make, he doesn't make. Doesn't make. Right? Okay. And to review the rules for the third person singular, rule number one. Ladies and gentlemen, rule number one. What do you say? What is the rule number one? Okay, Doodle is going to help us, right? And rule number one as is to the base form of most verbs. Thank you, Doodle. Thank you very much. Good. So in this case, we say make, makes. Send, sends. Help, helps. Talk, talks. But be careful. Don't say they, they makes. And... No, they they makes no, they make. Don't say you sense, you sense. No. We helps. Mm -mm. I talks. No, no, no. This is exclusive with she and he, right? And it, but uh, the most important is he and she, right? Or singular, the student, my brother, my friend, the teacher, the doctor, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. We say makes. Sense helps and talks. Good. Rule number two, please. Dino is going to help us. Dino, please come come here. Dino, come here. Mm, good evening. Rule number two says. Eh? What is rule number two? Dino. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Number two. As as. No, sorry. As e s. Two verbs that end in s, s h, c h. X and Z. Good. S, C, H, S, H, X, and Z. In, in those verbs, notice, for example, here, brush. Brush ends in the, in the letter uh, S, H. Look. Watch, C, H. Dress with S. Fix with X. Right? So in those cases, you don't have S. You add ES, right? ES. Understand? ES. So brush, brushes, watch, watches, dress, dresses, fix, fixes, right? Good. Rule number three. Uh, it says, the rule number three says, me, me, I want to say again. Okay. Rule number three says, change the Y. To I and then add ES. Excellent. Also, doodly. That's, that's the rule, right? For example, cry. <laughs> cry, you know. You, you, you change the Y to I and then you say cry and then ES. Cries. Try, tries. Study, studies, etc., etc. But remember that the Y must be preceded by the vowel. No, by a concern, right? For example, 
R is a consonant, right? This is R is a consonant. So before the consonant, no, after the consonant, sorry, we have the Y. Also with the verb study, look. Study. Studies. So is preceded by the vowel, by the consonant, sorry, uh, D. Consonant D, right? Okay. Study, studies, right? But what happened when it's preceded by the, by a vowel? For example, play, the letter A, right? Enjoy, the vowel O. Good evening. So, hey, hello, Ernesto, Mr. Melgar. Welcome to the class. Uh, Ernesto, we're making a review for the rules of the third person singular, right? Repaso de la, los verbos en tercera persona singular en el presente simple. Uh, qué largo. <laughs> okay. Okay. So we say, instead of say, uh, she make, you say, she makes. Instead of say, he brush, he brush, you say, he brushes. Instead of say, uh, cry, you say, cries. But in this case, remember now the class, that if the Y is preceded by a vowel, no changes. Only at the S, right? Play, plays, enjoy, enjoys. Okay? Don't forget that. And finally, the irregular forms, the irregular form, me, 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 I want to say. Mm, for example, do, does, go, goes, have, haves, no. No habits. Oh, I'm sorry. Is has. Have, has. Be, is. She is, he is. The dinosaur is. Dudley is. My brother is. Okay, enough. You know, thank you. <laughs> okay. So, uh, these are the regular forms, you know? So, what do you have to do with these rules? Memorize. No more. Teacher, example again? No. Memorize. Memory. Teacher, a conversation? No, 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 no. no. Memorize. Simple. No other form, right? Like the multiplication, right? Memorize. The capital of the word, memorize. Right? That's the only way. Good. But even though, do you have questions? Do you have questions, class? No questions? Good. So, eh, in the meantime, you review. En lo que ustedes lo repasan, right? I will take the attendance. Uh, según el reporte, Ana María, Josué y Maybe están de oyentes. Pero igual, mándenme el mensaje ahí de, de asistencia, ¿ok? Ana María. Brian, Claudia, present. Thank you, Chris, Mr. Arias Pereira, present. Okay, thank you. Um, Daisy, present. Thank you. Welcome, Daisy. Uh, Dagoberto. Present. Thank you. Glenda. Present. Okay. Griselda. Present. Thank you. Uh, Jorge. Present. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, Carolina. Miss Elaya Cordoba. Present. Okie dokie, Carolina, welcome. Um, Marcela. Present teacher. Oh. Can you participate, Marcela? Puede participar. Si no molesta mi tono. No, no, no. 
Es, es está el Alejandra Guzmán, ok. Ay, ya casi <laughs> tiene pocos niños. Oh, sorry, sorry to hear that, sorry. Le vamos a poner a participar, pero porciones chiquitas para que no me esfuerce mucho, ok. Ok, yes. thank you, thank you, Marcela. Ok, eh, Mario, eh, no sé si va a estar de oyente, Mario, quiero ver si está con nosotros, Mario. Se está bastante mal de salud, Mario. Solo me dijo que iba a estar de oyente, pero no, no está de oyente. Bueno, esperamos se recupere pronto. Más te necesita, Mario. Ok, Ernesto. Presente, teacher. Thank you. Marlon. Presente, teacher. Thank you. Maybe ya me dijo que va en el transporte. Eh, Otmar. Present. Thank you. Saúl. Present. Thank you. Jancy. Present, teacher. Thank you very much. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's continue, right? Do you have a question? Oh, look at this. I have two messages. Uh, present, maybe, uh-huh. En Ana María, ok, de oyentes. Ya le tomamos la asistencia, Ana María. Ah, no, aquí se lo voy a escribir, no voy a hacer que no me puede escuchar. Ok. Ok. Now let's continue, right? Good, let's practice. Let's begin with eh, Claudia. Claudia, for the, for the third person singular, wash, what is the form for wash? Mm. Third person singular. Let, let me show you. Let me show you. Good. Mm. Remember, uh -huh. we, have, Creo que se... we have three rules. Uh -huh. You add Hola? S, you add S, you add ES, and you change the white to I, and then you add ES, right? Three rules. And the regular form. Mm -hmm. So in the case of... Yes, yeah, yeah. yes correct. Yes. Excellent. Also, Claudia. So we say W, A. Continue, Claudia. S, A, E, S. Okie dokie. Hong, hong, hong. Very good. Now, wash, wash it, right? Next one, Chris. Can you help me, Chris? Practice. Practices. Mm -hmm. Spell, please. P. P R A C T I C E S. Okie dokie. Next one. Uh, Daisy. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Te duele la cabeza. Ok, give me a second. Por aquí tengo un micrófono encendido. Ok. Excuse me, excuse me. Eh, Daisy, turn on your microphone. Ahora sí enciende el suyo, eh, Daisy. Es. Daisy. Puede encender su micrófono, Daisy. Es. H. H. A. B. I. Mm. No, right? E. <laughs> okay. S H A B E E. E. Only one letter. They see only one S. letter. Yes, correct. Very good. Thank you. Another message, teacher. Oh.
Okay, now let's continue, right? Visit. This it is for Dagoberto, please. Visit, Dagoberto. Visit. V. I. S. I. T. S. Okie dokie. Exercise, right? Exercise. Um, Glenda, please. E X E R C I S E X. Okie dokie. Exercises, right? Exercises. Thank you very much. Now, after Glenda, uh, Griselda, please play. E L A Y S. Okie dokie, place, right? Why we don't change here? Because the Y is preceded by a vowel, no consonant, right? Vowel, so you only add the S. Thank you very much, Griselda. Okay, next one. Hey, Jorge, help me with number seven, please. Takes T A K E S. Okie dokie. Next one. Do, right? Uh, can you help me, please? Um, Carolina? Okay. Uh, D O S. Mm. No. Remember, these are in the irregular, right? Irregular. Los que se okay. salen del guacal. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Do you want to check? Okay, let's check. Okay. Irregular. Ah, Number okay. Four. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. D. Uh, D. O. E. Eh, perdón. Eh, I. S. Okie dokie. That, right? Thank you. This one is very difficult. Thank you, Carolina. Now, next one, please. Eh, Marcela. Yes, teacher. Es Slowly, slower, D right? V you? D J S. Okay, but let's go to the rule. Let's go to the rule. Give me a second here. Look, look, Marcela, number three, right? You change the Y to I. And then you add ES, right? Change the Y to I, and then you add ES. Oopsie, oopsie. So, sorry, give me a second. Okay, here. Ready, Marcela? S, B, U, B, E, I, E S. Okie dokie. Thank you. Study, right? Thank you. Thank you very much. Number 10. Um, after Marcela, we have Ernesto, please. Okay. H. H. H B. E. S. Mm. No lo sé, Rick. Remember the irregular? Oh, okay. A. 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 Again. A. 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 B. B. 
two. Okay, Malo. Let's go to back and say the regular, right? Oh, Remember oh, the regular, yes, number how? four. Has, yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> memorize, memorize, <laughs> memorize. <laughs> Sorry, no sorry. No problem, no problem. Okay. Age? It's just, it's, it's just a question of memory. <laughs> uh, age? A? S. Okie dokie, thank you. Mm -hmm. Number 11, please. This is for mm, Marlon, yeah. right? Marlon? G O. G O. G O is not correct. No, it's irregular. Irregular. Okay. G O E S. Good. Goes right. It's not Gobierno El Salvador. No, it's goes. Right. Brush. Okay, after Marlon, we have uh, uh, Otmar. Otmar, please. Reportando sobre el clima. Acá solo pasó una llovizna con dentisca. <laughs> <laughs> menos mal, <laughs> menos mal. <laughs> Otmar, please, brush. Este, B, R, U S H yes E S brushes, right? Good. Let's practice pronunciation. Repeat after me, please. Wash washes. Practice practices. Shave shaves. Visit visits. Exercise, exercises. Play, plays. Take, takes. Do, does. Study, studies. Have, has. Go, goes. Brush, brushes. Very good. Excellent also right now. Let's continue with the next one. Good. It says complete each sentence with the simple present. Use the could, right? So he. Number two, he. Then after break after breakfast, he, etc., etc., right? Now we're ready to make groups. Ladies and gentlemen, to make it this very easy and fast, I will make just two groups, right? Por todos los oyentes, pues, uh, vamos a hacer solo dos grupos. Me nombra un presidente o secretario, please. Y solo uno va a escribir. Just one, right? The answer, on. solo la respuesta. Uh, give a screenshot, please. Capture pantalla ahorita, please. Hoy no tenemos a Mario, pero por ahí me puede ayudar alguien a subirlo a los, al chat. Para que todos lo tengamos, okay? Good. Now, group number one. Daisy, Glenda, Griselda, Marcela, Ernesto, Marlon, Otmar, and Jancy. Group number two. Ana María, que está de oyente, Claudia, Chris, Dagoberto, Jorge, Carolina, maybe que todavía no ha llegado a casita, en Saúl, right? Ready, que tengo un mensaje. Ok, thank you, Marcela. ¿Ya tienen la imagen en el chat? Ok, very good. Now, ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Action.
Marlon, ¿todo bien? Deme la aceptar ahí, Mario. Maybe... Sí, se me queda fuera de los grupos. Bueno, vamos, voy, a, voy a pasar al otro grupo, Marlon, entonces. Lo voy a mover al grupo 2. Vaya, ahí dele, Marlon. Ana María, si me escucha, una es el grupo uno, por favor. Maybe, me copia, maybe. Por favor, unirse al grupo dos. Maybe. Ana María y Maybe, unirse al grupo 2. Se ve, no. Quizás no va. Sí, se, sí. Yo sí la veo. Ok, entonces vamos a, vamos a trabajar con esto. ¿va? Me imagino que aquí vamos a utilizar el presente simple siempre. ¿va? Y orden. Ernesto, I name you the president of the group, right? Lo nombramos al presidente del grupo, Ernesto. <laughs> ok, teacher. Ayúdenmele todos, Ernesto. Ok, please, go. Mm -hmm. bueno, bueno, comencemos con el number one. ¿no? Come home, he, it. He comes home at six yo no, no me acuerdo cómo para poder digitar acá. A ver. Y si lo pasa a un Word y lo va editando hacia abajo con un número. Solo reformando la oración. También se puede. Uh -huh. Ahorita. Con el 4, sí. He gets. Con la S. Sí. Con He, la gets. S. He gets undressed at 10 p.m. La quinta sería he goes. He goes. Goes, goes, goes. 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 He goes to be. To bed. At 11. Let's see. She watch. Washes. Las seis. Watches. 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 He watch, she watches TV after dinner. She eats. La otra es she eats. Con ese she al final. Eats. eats. Dinner at eight. Uh -huh. El ocho sería she puts, 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 con puts. S, S al final, S al final, on, on makeup, makeup, on makeup after breakfast. Uh -huh. no, it's, she makes, she makes, con S al final. She makes lunch at noon. El otro es she brushes. Bushes. Bushes. After breakfast, he comes his hair. Primero mm -hmm. sería after breakfast. 
Vamos a ver. Number three. Después del desayuno, Juan. Después del desayuno. A ver. Yo creería sí. que es he, has, he come, he come is higher of breaks fat. Creo yo que es así. As, no, quiero ver. Lo que pasa es que fue como esta elaboración y me hice con mayúscula. Creería que empieza con after breakfast. Sí. He comes is hey. Break, breakfast. Um, Vamos a ver. Después de desayuno, fresca. Uh -huh. He. 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 he eh, es, este es el verbo. ¿eh? Get, ver. He come is higher. ¿Sería así? No, el verbo es come. No. ¿Cuál es el verbo? Come. Es que está copiando la, la cuarta. Eh, aquí, el, el verbo, ¿cuál es que cambia? Con eso. Con Vale, termina con ese. Con ese rollo. ¿Será así? His. Se mantiene hero. he. ¿Cuál es el verbo? El, el ¿Mm? verbo es comes. Bueno, termina con ese. Es. ¿Es correcto? Le falta he. Antes de comes. Come, his, he comes, his face. Eh, ah, aquí falta, es cierto, tiene razón. Bien. Sí. ¿Nueve? ¿Qué, ¿Quién era la que estaba escribiendo? Se salió. No. Se le fue la señal, quizás. Ah, le pasó. Se le fue. She sí, make sí. lunch at noon. Bueno, ya lo sabemos, She no necesita, necesita lo anotado. De todas formas, Cristian lo va a decir. Claro, con gusto. Claro, con gusto, con los ojos cerrados. Chris, that, that is the attitude, Chris. Nice. More, no more precisamente coffee. con los ojos cerrados, pero. More coffee, Christian. Con, con los ojos cerrados, Christian. Es because Chris, Chris Sorry, is, is drinking coffee. Drinking coffee, so Chris yeah. energy. Cheers. Okay, I have bad okay. news for you. I have bad news, malas noticias, right? Uh, the, the other group is with number three. El grupo, el otro grupo apenas va a Pero hay hacer, que volverlo a hacer, creo yo, porque la compañera se le fue la señal y no, solo ya lo notó. No, hombre, oh, no, porque él, él ya lo tenemos aprendido, sí, eso está, pero fácil aquí. Excelente, George. Ah, pues like él it. lo va a decir, dice no, el compañero. No, no vamos a decir uno cada uno para que vayamos aprendiendo. <laughs> Y el otro grupo, ¿qué pasó? Eh, apenas van por la tres. Mándame <ríe> para el otro grupo, le voy a ayudar. ¿Really? Sí, de verdad. Yeah, yeah, okay, good. La, la idea es ayudar. Ok, good. En este momento lo mando entonces. Me okay. ok, we, we send the... El apagafuegos, es George. <laughs> okay, but in this is correct. You can say, for example, uh, number one, Chris, number two, Dago, number three, Marlon, number four, Ra Saul, right? Number six, Carolina, right? Number seven, maybe, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, okay? Good. You, you're, you're faster. Faster means más rápidos. Ustedes son más rápidos. You're faster, right? Okay, I will go. I will, I will go and help too. Be patient, please. Be patient. Ténganme paciencia con ese grupo, ¿ok? Ok. Good. Wait. Uh, you can talk about your, the activities that you did on the weekend. Si quieren, practiquen qué actividades hicieron el fin de semana, ¿ok? En lo que termina el otro grupo. Ok. Good. No está, va, espera, espera. Ah, ya no lo había visto. Espera, espera, espera. A, A, W, A. Ya lo vi. Ok. Así. Es al final. Ok. Y, what's it? TV after dinner. 
Okay. After dinner. Sí. Ok, el séptimo es She eats sí. con S sí. al final. She eats dinner, dinner. S. At ok. Bien, vamos. No, no lleva, no lleva eso. A ver, ok. El número 8 es she. She puts a makeup for breakfast. Not que. Sí, sería. Makeup after breakfast. Breakfast. Ok. El 9. She. She makes lunch. She makes lunch. She makes lunch. Dale. At noon. ¿Qué pasó? El 10. Before bed, she brushes. No. He brushes. Her her teeth before bed. She brushes her teeth before bed. Hay que arreglar una que, te, que está mala. La número, la número tres. Sí, la tres. La tres. So, baja el cuadro porque quiero verlo, porque la 3 sí está mal. Ahí está. La, la 3. After, after la, la, he comes. Es, quiero ver. Sí. Es he, he, comes. he. He comes con B al final. Borralo ahí, exacto. He comes. He comes. His, his hair. hair after breakfast. His Hey, ajá. Ahí uh -huh. vas a poner after breakfast. He comes. Uy, perdón. Me equivoqué, va. Vale. Aquí, aquí va, va. Los tres. Here. Y after, va. After breakfast. Uh -huh. Sí, va. Welcome. Let's start with the exercise, right? Group number one, please. Number number one, help me, please. Is he comes home Sorry. at six? At, at six. Excellent. So number two, group number two. Group number two, please. He shaves. He shaves. Before breakfast. He shaves. Before breakfast. Teacher. What? I'm sorry, and I am the group too. Ah, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Number three. After breakfast, he 
Group number one, sorry, group number one. Group number one. He comes his hair, right? Thank hair. you. Hair, no, his hair because he's a man, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, number four. Uh, he. Group number two, please. Gets undressed. Yes, he gets undressed. Mm, in this case, I'm going to do this. Undress. At 10 p.m., right? Good. Group number one. He goes to bed. He goes to bed. He goes to bed at 11. Good. Then group number two, she. She watches TV. Watches TV. Watches TV after dinner, right? And number seven, group number one. She eats dinner. He eats dinner. At eight o'clock, right? Good. Then number eight. Group number she two. Puts, she puts on. Hmm, makeup, right? Maquillaje, makeup, makeup. After breakfast. Good. Then number nine, please. Group number one. She makes lunch. She makes lunch. She makes lunch at noon, right? And finally, before bed, group number two. Brushes. Yeah. She brushes. She, she brushes. Her teeth, right? No, my teeth, her teeth. Thank you very much. Repeat after me, Pete. Repeat after me. He comes home at six. He shaves before breakfast. After breakfast, he combs his hair. He gets undressed at 10 p.m. He goes to bed at 11. She watches TV after dinner. She eats dinner at eight o'clock. What a she eats dinner at eight. She puts on makeup after breakfast. She puts on makeup after breakfast. She makes lunch at noon. Before bed, she brushes her teeth. Good. Uh, Marlon, can you read number one to five, please? Number one to five. Please read for the class. What number, teacher? One to five. Uh -huh, okay, he comes home at 6 o'clock. He shaves before breakfast. Um, after breakfast, he comes his hair. He gets undressed at 10 p.m. 
the opposite. Andres, Andres. He goes to the Andres, at... right? huh? Marlon, uh, number four is gets Andres. The vestirse, right? Andres. He, okay. Como no está en la misma línea. He gets Andres at 10 p.m. He goes to bed at uh, 11 o'clock. Good. Thank you very much. Griselda, please. Number six to ten. Read, please. He watches TV after dinner. He eats at eight o'clock. She eats dinner? She eats dinner? She eats dinner at eight o'clock. She puts on makeup after breakfast. She makes lunch at noon. Before bed, she brushes her teeth. Excellent. Also, thank you very much. Let's continue, class. What time is it? It's almost nine, right? So I will make a breakfast. Breakfast. I will make a break. I will make a break. And right, uh, we're going to go to the yes, no question. But before to go to this, let's go to the to the platform, right? Let's go to the platform. Okay, unit two, right? That's number one. That's number six, I'm sorry. Tarea número seis, right? <clears throat> okay. Um, let me see. Uh, today, some of you were telling me that you have some problem with this part, right? Algunos me dijeron que tenían eh, algunos inconvenientes con este ejercicio, right? Let me see. Um, Daisy. Sí. ¿Le salió al fin el ejercicio? Eh, sí. Lo que no había hecho era ponerle como la plequita donde es el don't uh -huh. y el punto. Ok. Entonces todos le salieron bien. Uh -huh. Ok. Muy bien, permítame. Good. Daisy Castellanos. Ok. Very good. Now, uh, ¿alguien más tuvo problemas con este ejercicio? El ejercicio 6, yes? Yes, I teacher. Uh, Raúl, with uh, uh, sentence number 4. Number 4, ajá. Uh -huh. In okay. docent. That's and and... Maybe is the apostrophe. Tal vez el apostrophe. Eh, ¿Por qué no hacemos una cosa, Saúl? Si gusta, póngalo, póngalo así, mire. Does not. Así, separado. Does not. Ah, no, ok. Para evitar, porque a veces sí, porque... El, el apóstrofe como que no lo identifica a veces. Sí, porque he probado con el apóstrofe y, y eh, le lo hice de varias formas y no me agarraba. Portugués lo puso con mayúscula. Sí. Sí, sí, va. Sí, Entonces, es... pruebe ahorita, pruebe ahorita y me dice. Ok. Good. Eh, ¿Alguien más que haya tenido problemas con este ejercicio? Nobody else? ¿Todos estamos bien? Ok. Good. Nos vamos a la tarea 7. Here. Bueno, esto es lo que vamos a repasar ahorita en el, en, en el PowerPoint, pero ahí pueden poner, do you like music? Yes, I do, o yes, I does. Creo que es bastante obvia la respuesta, ¿verdad? Es que... No me, no me le den copia a nadie, ¿eh? Ustedes solitos ahí. Ni en el chat. Uh -huh. No lo sé, Rick. <risa> ok. Da Sara. Recuerden que Sara es una ella, una singular, ¿verdad? No, ¿ve? Negativo. No. No chidasen o no chidas. Ahí llegan ustedes solitos, ¿verdad? Do you and Wendell? Tú y Wendell, right? ¿Cómo respondemos cuando me dicen tú y Wendell? ¿Nosotros o, o ellos? Ahí ustedes deciden. Bueno. Roberto. Roberto is a he. And is negative. 
And finally, Laura and Sally, right? So, guess two ways. Mm -hmm. Yo no me deja, no me deja entrar este, a, la plataforma, a la plataforma del celular. Tengo, tendría que usarlo desde la compu, pero este, no sé pero, si lo puedo mañana por lo mismo del, del, del web. No hay problema, no, no hay problema. Este, esto tendría que haber estado el viernes, pero todavía tenemos tiempo, ¿verdad? Así es que me recomendaron en inglés corporativo que, que termináramos la unidad 2 y el examen de medio curso, que ya lo vamos a comenzar. En teoría, ¿hasta qué tarea tendríamos que tener terminada? Hasta la tarea 10 y el examen. Ah, pues el examen me falta. Ah, vale. La tarea ya, ya la hice. Yo pensé la... que iba atrasado en la tarea. No, no. Usted sí, ya va yo por igual la, tengo la... todas, pero solo con, esa, con esa, esa pregunta. Tengo todas, solo esa pregunta es la que me falla. Vaya, y, inténtelo con el das not, sin contracción, ¿verdad? Y Jorge creo que ya va por la tarea 23, creo, ¿verdad? Se nos pasó, Jorge. Yo... No, yo voy ya por el por la por el examen. Excelente, ya vamos a ir todos juntos. Okay. Pueden, pueden hacerlo ustedes solitos, ¿verdad? Pero para cualquier duda, pues aquí estoy a sus órdenes. Good. Eh, number nine. Ah, no se pudo. Ahí está. Por activity, right? Esto ya lo vimos, pero repasemos aquí. ¿Qué está haciendo este chico de, co de cobija verde? Takes a shower, wakes up, or shaves. Pero si, no, 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 cero copia, no, 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 Please. pregunta retórica, <laughs> se responde, good, brushing his teeth, takes a shower or shaves, this picture, right, hasta hablando por el celular está este muchacho, bueno, estos celulares ya no hay, verdad, ok, next one, wakes up, shaves or brushes his teeth, entre dormido y despierto, And the last one. This is a razor, look. Rasurador, a razor. So tell me, please. Okay. And finally, task number 10, right? I go to work, I goes to work, or I am to work. Okay, number two. I usually drives. To work driving or drive I always esta parte ya la vimos verdad sería I always I am check check or I am check my emails okay And number four, I don't always reply, reply or replies. Aquí si ya saben con cuál poner la S, pues no les va a costar, es fácil. And finally, I have lunch, I has lunch or I am lunch. I am lunch. <laughs> okay, sorry, sorry. Es que me suena divertido, I am lunch. Teacher. <laughs> Yo soy almuerzo. <laughs> I'm sorry. Teacher. Ajá, uh -huh, yes, yes. En la en la cuatro, en esa que usted está diciendo ahorita, eh, yo le puse reply. En la primera le puso. No, la puse en la última, en la tercera, uh -huh, la pero... que lleva ese. Pero me salía incorrecta. De uh -huh. ahí yo la puse en la segunda y ahí sí me salió correcta. Ok, entonces usted no es, le está dando copia al grupo, entonces ahorita. No, no le estoy preguntando <risa> si está bien o, o, o yo me equivoqué. No, si, si la plataforma le dio bien es que está bien. ¡Cling! Ah, vaya. No, no, no lo no, sé. Solo, era, sutilmente... solo era una pregunta. Claro, el así como decir, teacher, la, la, esta era, va. Ah. Eh, no, nada, era solo una, solo una duda. Sí, correcto, correcto, eso era una duda, sutilmente, ¿eh? le, está dando, le, le está dando copia a todo ahí, y mire, no, mira ahí Claudia, mejor que, me den copia, mejor que me den copia a mí, mire Claudia, copiando la respuesta está ahorita Claudia, Ajá. Ah. sí, sí, está correcto, está correcto, ¿verdad?, pero por supuesto, ah, en teoría no les puedo dar copia, ¿verdad?, 
Ok, no, let's go to the test. Ok, <risa> you're welcome. En, en teoría, que... en teoría, <coughs> pero en la práctica es otra cosa. Ajá, Jorge, de los copiones. <risa> <ya. risa> Quiero saber cuándo es el examen. Ahorita hacerlo, vamos. Ahorita mismo. Ay, bien. no, porque es eh, profe. Está fácil, el mismo, el examen es el mismo que hemos hecho. Está fácil, no. Ok, let's Jorge, go que nos ayude. Ah, no, ya vi que Jorge es de los que da copia. Mm, no lo sé, Rick. Vamos a tener que ir bloqueando a Jorge. Ok, number se, one, please. Se estudia para aprender y se copia para pasar. Mm, no lo sé, Rick. Ok, number one, please. Eh, Michelle is a she. So, Michelle are, Michelle a is, o Michelle is. Right? Ahí cualquiera de las tres opciones. Vamos a la par, por favor, todos respondiendo. Teacher, ya me agarró la, la, la número cuatro, la traía número seis. Does not. Teacher, es yes. que ahorita Excellent. estamos abriendo el, el examen. Es Excellent. que yo estoy en el teléfono y... I know, y I know, Saúl. So. I understand, Saúl, so. no problem. Take your time, take your time. Ajá, Marlon. No, que cómo puedo hacer porque yo estoy desde el teléfono y pues para, para abrir el examen tengo que salirme. ¿O cómo puedo hacer? No, 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 no. ¿Cómo que tiene que salir? No voy a hacer que está lloviendo por ahí, Marlon. Lo que podemos hacer es lo siguiente, Marlon. Eh, este, vaya usted viendo aquí conmigo en la pantalla y vaya anotando su respuesta. Solo la respuesta. ¿Ok? Y después ya cuando termine la clase ya se va usted al examen solito. Ah. ¿Yes? Bueno. Bueno. Pero me va a dar tiempo de hacerlo porque eso me puede preocupar si hay tiempo para hacerlo. Claro, hay tiempo, sí. Sí, gracias a Dios sí, estar en esta lista. Como le comenté a... Ok. Very good. Very good. Now, number two. Vaya anotando, Marlon. Es que mire, Marlon, ahí, ahí me estaban diciendo, y si me salgo, yo, yo pensé que se iba a salir de la casa. Pero no, ¿verdad? Okay, no, de no. la casa no, si me salgo de la casa. Sí, ya lo sé, Marlon, todos estamos molestando. Number two. He is not a floor manager. He am not a floor manager. O he isn't. Solo que el apóstrofe va al final, ¿verdad? Tengan cuidado ahí. ¿Seguimos, Marlon? Sí, está bien. Yeah, yes. Ok, number three. I am a assembler. I am an assembler. O I are an assembler, right? Recuérdense que comienza con vocal. Ensamblador. Um, um. ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo dijeron? I is. Ah, sí, es la correcta. I is, yes. I don't, I am, creo que es la respuesta. I don't, I am, esa es. Yes. Um, um. Hey, hey, qué pa. Chris, Chris, le vamos a dar punto y está dando copia. Ok, number four. Are we friends? Are we friends? No, you are not. No, we are not. O no, they are not. Aquí es cuestión de sujeto, ¿verdad? Y se si viene el sujeto, pues ya lo hicieron. Ok, number five. Are your bosses here? Remember, it's plural, bosses, right? Plural. Yes, we are. Yes, you are. Or yes, they are. Okay, let's continue. Number two. Muy rápido, teacher. Ah, so let's con come back, right? Number one. Number two. Number five. 
number five, right? Are your bosses here? Están tu jefes aquí? Are your bosses here? Only the answer, right? No, no me copie okay, la thank you. No me copie la, la pregunta, malo, ma, solo la respuesta, nada más. Para que no, no se tarde yes. mucho. Okay, yeah. That's right. okay. okay, good. Number two, right? This is a question of, of order, right? Of the alphabet. What letter comes before the Q? Antes de la Q, right? Before Q. Before the Q. If you know the alphabet, A, B, C, D. Easy. How many letters, right? ¿Cuántas letras? How many letters are there in the English alphabet? Letters. letters, right? How many? 26, 27, or 28? If you want to be sure, go to the manual. In the manual, you have the answer, right? Number three, which are the vowels? The vowels. The vowels. Which are the vowels? Our teacher is from Canada. Our teacher is, yes, of course, I am from Canada. Look at the teacher, right? I am, look very Canadian. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Now, uh, right, correct, cling, or wrong? And is the sentence correct or incorrect? Marlon, vamos al paso, Marlon? Yes. Yes, okay, good, good. Number five. Their class is at night. The sentence is correct or the sentence is incorrect. Okay, let's continue, right? That's part number three. My boss, singular, singular my boss, right? Are Elmer Argueta. Mm, my boss are, this is incorrect, right? So, but what is the correction? My boss is, my boss mine, or my boss Ares? Bird to be, right? Number two, Nadia and Rita is the new teachers. Nadia and Rita is. Incorrect, right? So Nadia and Rita am, are, or teacher. Teacher, usted sabe en la computadora cómo se saca el apóstrofe. In my computer is next to the, the number zero. En mi computadora está la parte del número cero. Right, let me show you. In another computer, you gotta um, press shift more number two. Shift two. What, what, what brand is your computer, Chris? ¿Qué, qué marca? Uh, my computer is um, Dell, I guess. Dell, well. The mine is HP. La mía es HP, entonces a la par del cero. Pero Los teclados son genéricos, debería de poder combinar para que le aparezca la diéresis. Sí, en mi caso no necesito ponerle shift, de una sola vez aparece, miren. Mm -hmm. Solo a la par del cero y ya estoy. 
Okay, continue, please. Number three. We am secretaries. We is. We are or we am not. Correction, please. Sure. Ready? Okay, number four. Again, right? Instead of say does, and si tienen problemas con el apóstrofe, pónganle does not. Si pueden, pero si pueden hacerlo con el apóstrofe, pues magnífico ahí. Don't forget the period. No se les olvide el punto final. Ready? Teacher, ya puedo salir para resolverlo. Uh, yo le sugiero que hasta que termine la clase, Marlon. Pero usted note ahí la respuesta. Vaya anotando la respuesta. Cuando entre en la plataforma en su computadora, ya solo a traer, va ella, solo a responder. ¿Ya? Pero si tiene alguna duda, díganme. Aquí estamos a la orden. Sir, yo, yes, sir. No, es que ya quiero hacerlo, es lo que pasa. <ríe> ok, si quiere, pero terminemos y, y después se sale un ratito, si quiere, y, y luego vuelve a entrar a la clase, ¿sí? Okay, yes. Let's go to the last one, right? Part four. Do you like music? Yes, I do, or yes, I does. Does Sarah know English? No, she doesn't, or no, she does. Do you and Wendell play the guitar? Yes, we do, or yes, they do. Does she brush her teeth before going to bed? Yes, does she? Yes, she does. Or yes, she do. Number five, do you take the bus at 7 a.m.? Do you, you, yes, they do, yes, we do, or yes, we do. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Any question about the exam?
Finish. Hasta qué tarea es, teacher? Perdón, sorry. Okay, uh, you have to make here. Look, I will show you. I will show you. You have to make section one. Tiene que hacer la sección uno. Section two, la sección dos, hasta la tarea diez. Hasta la tarea diez. Y luego me hace el examen final de perdón de medio curso, midterm test, right? Que tiene cuatro secciones. Hasta ahí tiene que llegar. Unidad 1 y 2 y el midterm. Si quiere puede empezar con la 3, pero Teacher, le recomiendo que y, se espere. Mm. Y ahí, ahí en el en el midterm 4, eso es la cuatro, solo en cuatro preguntas, la videoconferencia que aparece, eso ya no. 1 2 3 4. Ajá. Hasta ahí lleva a llegar. Ah, ok. No more. No more, right? Ok. Luego en la sección 3, pues hacemos la 3 y en la sección 4, sección 4 y examen final. Programado para el 20, no, 17. ¿Eh? Let, me see, let me see. Today is November, right? Perdón, déjeme ver November. No, este, para el 24 sería. No se puede. No nos podemos depelar el siguiente día en el carnaval de San Miguel. <risa> no, I'm sorry. Sorry, no, no carnaval, no carnaval. <risa> ok, good. Any question, class? Bueno, después de la clase voy a revisar la plataforma y espero que todos me hayan terminado las tareas, ¿ok? Para reportársela a, a inglés corporativo y ellos de una sola vez a Insafor, ¿ok? Good. Let's go, let's continue with the class. Okay, now we're going to continue re making a review of the yes, no questions. In the yes, no question, we use the auxiliary do, right? We use the auxiliary do, or we use the auxiliary does. Do or does, right? Do you or does she? Do you or does she, right? So, do you like pizza? Auxiliary, subject, verb, and complement. Auxiliary, subject, verb, and complement. Auxiliary, subject, verb, and complement. Does she live in La Union? Okay. Now, look at this. Do I ask for assistance? Yes, you do. Oh, no, you don't. Do you ask for assistance? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Do we ask for assistance? Yes, you do. No, you don't. Do they ask for assistance? Yes, they do. No, they do. Do eh, Marlon and Jorge ask for assistance? For example? Yes, they do. No, they don't. Okay, and does, does he, does she, does it, does my friend, does my brother, does Saul, does Griselda, does Claudia, etc., etc., right? Does Otmar. So we use does with he, she, and it, and some singular, right? Questions? This is the structure of the yes, no question, right? Now let's go to, to one exercise. Here we have six questions. Let me see, uh, uh, six questions, right? Now let's work in groups. But before I will take the attendance, let me see, Ana Maria. <laughs> okay, ya puede participar Ana Maria, o oh, siempre es de oyente, ¿verdad? No, no, ya. Yeah. yeah, okay, good. Brian? Claudia? Hola, hola. 
Chris. Presente. Okay, thank you. Daisy. Present. Dagoberto. Present. Glenda. Present. Griselda. Present. Jorge. Present. Okay, Josué está de oyente. And Carolina. Present. Marcela. Present, teacher. Ernesto. Present, teacher. Mario. Bueno, no se conectó Mario. Me dijo que iba a estar de oyente, pero esperamos que se recupere pronto. Eh, Marlon. Present, teacher. Maybe. Present. Ya está en casita, maybe. Sí, ahorita voy llegando. Ah, excelentoso. Eh, Otmar. Present. Saúl. Saúl. Jansi. Present. Ah, okay, Present. Good. good, good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now we're going to make three groups. Creo que estamos bastante, así que vamos a hacer tres grupos, ¿ok? Remember, only one is the secretary. Para no perder tiempo, solo uno es el secretario o presidente, los demás copian, ¿ok? Make the screenshot. Háganme el screenshot. Veo que Marcela es buenísima en esto, así que háganme el screenshot y me lo manda al chat, Marcela, por favor. Okay, ready? Now let's make the groups. I'm on a group of Jantons, chicos. I'm going to make three groups. Ahí está ya. Okay, thank you, Marcela. Okay, ready? Group number one, Claudia, Daisy, Griselda, Carolina, and Omar. Group number two, copy, please. Copy, copy. Again, Claudia, Daisy, Griselda, Carolina, and Omar. Group number two, Dagoberto, Marcela, Ernesto, Marlon, maybe, and Saúl. Dagoberto, Marcela, Ernesto, Marlon, maybe, and Saúl. Group number two. Group number three. Ana María, Chris, Glenda, Jorge, and Jansi. Right? Good. So what are you going to do here is to complete the, same, the, the questions using do or does. <clears throat> si se dan cuenta, en las preguntas no aparece el auxiliar. Ustedes se lo van a agregar, ¿ok? Here we go. Hello, it's in the chat, right? La captura está en el chat. Okay. Yes, please. Pero no puedo compartir. Mm. Oh, sí, creo que sí. Voy a irme al chat. Voy a compartir pantalla. O lo que puede hacer es copiar la imagen y abrir un Word y pegarla ahí en Word. Y puede compartir.
No puedo. ¿Quién me le ayuda a Daisy, please? Carolina, usted buena en, en la compu. Hoy estoy desde mi celular, por eso ah, me ha costado un poquito más, sí, pero ah. estoy tratando de, pero en el chat no me aparece porque solo me aparece el del grupo, o sea, el de que acabamos de crear, ¿no? El, bueno, el entonces, se, se, les voy a compartir entonces, y ahí le dan otra vez, eh, ok, copy, ahorita, copy pega, copy pega ahí, screenshot. Ok, ¿quién va a ser el presidente? ¿President? Ya capturé la pantalla, quiero ver si puedo compartir, pero dice que está compartiendo alguien más. Ah, ok, voy a dejar de compartir porque soy yo. Ok, <ríe> soy yo. ahorita voy. Muy bien. Ok. ¿Pueden verla? Ok, bye. Bye, chicos, demos. Extra large. XG le pongan. <laughs> <laughs> Number I, five. I do. I do. Uh, no, do I need? Así va. Sí. Do I need? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, sí. Pero el ventilador. Ah, es que con la Xiomara estaba hablando. Nombre Sips. Do you like Tom, his boss? No. Tom, Tom like his boss. That's Tom. Why? Does Tom like his boss? Ah, es correcto. That's Tom. La, 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 dos meses, dos meses, dos meses. Das Tom. No, no va el Tom. Das Lai. Like. Das Lai. Like. No. 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 No sería Das Tom. Sí, porque es. Tom, uh -huh. Tom like. His Primero Tom. es el auxiliar, luego el, el sujeto. Bueno, en el 5, vámonos para el 5. Glenda 5 sería. Sería Dubea. Cristian. Jansen, Ana María. I do, I do need sería. No. Sí, I, I do need, sí. I do need a tie at work. Sí. I do need a tie at work. Ok. 
aquí sería number five what is the auxiliary is... in number five is necessary the auxiliary remember do and or does do and does do is do teacher on a question yes tell number me number four um tengo una duda con el verbo mm -hmm. de, es, la verdad no sé si es have o has okay do you need the auxiliary Jorge, do you need the auxiliary, yes or no, in number four? Uh, yes. Because it's a question. What is the auxiliary, do or does? Does. Okay, good. And remember what I say. Every time you use does, it's not necessary to change the verb. Okay? So what, entonces, is, what is the question, Jorge? Ah, entonces sería, does this, this store have? No era has, yo sabía. No <ríe> tenía duda. Gracias, teacher. You're welcome. You're welcome. Para Tom, la dijimos, Tom es él. No había detergente y me lo abonaron al monedero selecto. Finish? Finish. Ok, good. Solo démele un, un minutito al otro grupo y luego nos vamos juntos. Yes? Ok. Good. Yes, I do. No, I don't. No sería ¿Ah? así. Do you, ah? No sería. Eh, is it a corbata? Yes. Do, do, you, do I need a teeth at work? Yes. Yes, I do. La, la pregunta es, ne ¿necesito una corbata para el trabajo? ¿Sí o no? La respuesta. No, I don't. <laughs> no, no sería eso. <laughs> Why? ¿Cuál sería? Porque la pregunta es, Okay, ready? Group number one, please. Group number one. Mm -hmm. Ernesto? Your rule number one. Uh -huh. What is the question, Ernesto? Num number one. Yeah, ahorita. Do you have blue shorts? Do you have blue shoes? And two yes. possibilities, right? Two possibilities. You say, yeah, oops. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Uh huh. Oh, no, I don't. Do. Oh, no. I don't, right? Okay, those are the possibilities. Yes or no, right? Good, group number two, please. Group number two. Do they have? Dagoberto and company. Uh -huh. Mario, el del grupo dos también, por eso me confundí. Ajá. Uh -huh. Do okay. they have cute children? Do they have? Do they have cute children? It says yes, they do. No, they don't. 
Yes, okay. they do. No, they don't. Group number three. Do you sister one a great sweet? Do your sister one one a great suit? Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, but sister is singular or plural? Uh, singular. Singular. So it's do or mm. does? Uh, do. Mm. Do. Does. 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 Like because it's singular. So does your sister want a great suit? A great suit, sorry. Yes, she does or no, she doesn't. Yes, okay. she does. Oh, no. She doesn't, right? No, she doesn't. Okay, those are the possibilities for the question. Good. Now, number four, group number one, please. Does this store? The, the, does this store... Uh huh. Have the sugar in extra large? Does this store have that sweater in extra large? Yes, it does, or no, it doesn't, right? Good. Number five, please. Group number two. Do I need a tie at, at work? Do you need a tie at work? Yes, you do. No, you don't. Yes, you do. No, no, sorry. It's I, right? Excuse oh, me. Do, do I need? Do I need? Excuse me. Yes. Que oso, que oso. Do I need a tie at work? Yes, you do. Or no, you don't, right? Number six. Group number three, please. Does Tom like his boss? His boss? The guy being su jefe at Tom? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't, right? Two possibilities. Now, repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Do you have blue shoes? Do they have cute children? Does your sister want a gray suit? Does this store have that sweater in extra large? Do I need a tie at work? Does Tom like his boss? Okay, good. Now, can you read for me, please, Linda? Read. Only you. Only you. Come on, Linda. Do you have the two? Ah. Uh, do they have two children? Does your sister want a guy sweet? Suit, suit, suit. Suit, suit. <laughs> Does your sister want a guy suit? Does the store have a sweat in extra large? Sweater, sweater, sweater. Does the store have that sweater is extra large? Do I need a tie at work? Tie? Tie? Do I need a tie at work? Does song like his food? Okie dokie. Thank you very much. Now let's continue. Let's continue. Good. 
Good. These are the activities that you do at your work, right? Know the policies, know the regulation, help workers, help people, help the company, advertise the company, design softwares, develop softwares, answer the phone, make phone calls. Now with these sentences, you can describe what do you do in your, your, on, in your company or what you don't do in the company. For example, you can say, I know the policies. I know the regulation, I help workers. Or you can say in negative, I don't. I don't know the policies. I don't know the regulations. I don't help workers. I don't help people. I don't help the company. So you can say uh, negative. Oh, you can make questions. Do you help the company? Do you advertise the company? Does he design softwares? Yes, I'm pagando. Yes. Okay, good. Let's continue, right? Write reports, send reports, uh, arrange meetings, carry boxes, carry products, keep track, repair computer, ask for assistance. Other activities are install programs, sell products, exchange information, buy new merchandise, receive money, decide what to buy, transport products, fix cars. So those are the activities you can do in your time. Now we're going to practice, right? Uh, here we have some daily routines and we're going to make sentences with this. For example, I say, get up, get dressed, take a shower, brush my teeth. I'm sorry, comb my hair, shave, put on makeup, eat breakfast, come home, make dinner, study, watch TV, go to bed, go to bed, right? Now we're going to uh, put some sentences, put some subjects in these sentences, right? For example, number one, I get up early. She gets dressed. My brother takes a shower. You brush your teeth. Right? Now here, I need you help me, please. Ana Maria, I need you add a, a subject. Agregame un sujeto. Add a subject to the action, comb my hair. You can say, Ana Maria, I comb my hair, you comb my hair, they comb my hair, she combs his hair. Excuse me, I will change. I comb my hair, you comb your hair, we comb our hair, she combs her hair, etc., etc., right? Ana Maria, please. Un, un sujeto es. Mm -hmm. She con my hair. Her hair, right? El uh, pelo de ella. Uh -huh. She con, uh -huh. she comes my hair. No, no, no. Ella no le peina pein el pelo a usted. Ah, no. <laughs> she comes her. Her. Uh -huh, her, her. Her, her, right? Her, 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 her. her. Thank you, Ana Maria. Chris, va caminando, Chris, o puede continuar. Hi. Ok, shave. Agreme un sujeto, Chris. Shave. Uh... My father shaves every day. Very good. Good sentence, right? Claudia? Put on makeup. Can I to participate? Okay, Marlon. But let me see if Claudia can, right? Después de Claudia, me va a ayudar usted, Marlon. Claudia? Okay. Claudia? 
En realidad no sé qué significa. Put on, eh, aplicarse uh -huh. el maquillaje, aplicarse el maquillaje, put on makeup. Okay. Sí. Sí, mm, aquí como que no. Aquí como que él, él se aplica el maquillaje como que no va mucho, ¿verdad? Pero sí es posible, sí. pero sí, ok, excelente, Claudia. Ups, sí, ¿qué hice? Permítame. Ups. Ok, ahí estamos. Sí. Permita. Creo que es. Puts, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. On my cap. Correct. Thank you. Thank you, Claudia. Now, please, Dagoberto. Eat breakfast. He always eats breakfast. Excellent. Hasta me agregó un adverbio de frecuencia. Thank you. Thank you very much. Daisy, please, come home. Daisy, mis castellanos, Arevalo, come home. Ok, Glenda, please. Sería, I might. Come home. Ah, come home. Eh... I come. I come. Mm. I come home. Yes, that's it. <laughs> Very good. Thank you. Now, Griselda, make dinner. They make dinner. They make dinner. Very good. Jorge, study. Jorge. Ok, Carolina, please. Study. Ah, Marlon, sorry, perdón, se me había quedado Marlon, sorry. Perdón, Marlon, se me olvidó que iba a participar. Qué oso, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Marlon. Ok, Marlon, study. Marlon? Okay. Eh, Marcela, please. Study. I like to study. I like to study. Oh, I study, right? Good. Thank you, Marcela. Thank you very much. Now, eh, Ernesto, please watch TV. I watch TV. Excellent. Okay, excellent. Very good. Now, uh, maybe go to bed, maybe. Yo go to bed. You go to bed. You go to bed. Good. Excellent, right? Now let's go to the next part. Free time activities, exercise, listen to music, play football, go out for dinner, go dancing, take a nap, read, check media, go to the movies, visit friends. Okay, now we are going to make negative sentences with this, right? I don't, she doesn't, etc., etc., right? Negative sentences. Now let's start with 
Otmar, please, exercise. Make a negative with exercise, Mar Otmar. I don't exercise, she doesn't exercise, you don't exercise, he doesn't exercise, my brother doesn't exercise, etc., etc., right? Otmar? Omar, do you copy? 10-4, 10-4, Omar. Otmar. Bueno, creo que no está copiando Otmar. Good. So, eh, Saúl, can you help me? Ah, por aquí está Otmar. Pero Otmar nos copia. Me copia, Otmar. No le funciona el micrófono, dice. Ah, el micrófono, ok, muy bien. Entonces, Saúl, sí. Ok. Uh, perdón, algo dice acá que no está bien. Aquí estamos. Sorry. Bueno, entonces vamos con Saúl. Saúl, ¿can you help me, Saúl? Saúl, bueno, creo que tiene problemas también con el celular. So, Jancy, please. Negative, Jancy. Um, negative. Mm -hmm. She does. She doesn't. Doesn't. Uh. Sí, dos, um... Ajá. Remember, it's subject, auxiliary, verb, right? So, she doesn't? She doesn't. Um... Exercise. She doesn't? Yancy? Ay, no sé, profe. Bueno, ¿Cuál está aquí a la par? ¿Qué está a la par aquí? ¿Qué dice? Uh, uh, exercise. Exercise. Good. She doesn't exercise. <laughs> Thank you. Listen to music. Eh, Ana María, listen to music. She does listen to music. She doesn't, right? Listen to music. Mm -hmm. Good. Play football, right? Uh, Claudia, play football? Negative? Hola, hola. Ajá, uh -huh. number, uh, play football, negative. Sí. Sí, I don't. She doesn't. Oh. Play football. Okay, thank you very much. She doesn't play football, right? Good. Now, go out for dinner. Go out for dinner. Can you help me, Chris? Sure. Uh, I don't go out for... I don't go out for dinner. Excellent. I don't go out for dinner. Go dancing, please, Dagoberto. I don't go dancing. Okay, Daisy, take a nap. Thank you, Dago. 
Daisy, take a nap in negative. Uh huh. Take a nap. Okay, now please, Glenda, take a nap. Negative. I don't take a nap. Good, thank you. Uh, um, after Glenda Griselda, please. Read. She doesn't read a book. She doesn't read a book. Very good. She doesn't read a book. Now, please, can you help me, Jorge? Can you help me? Go to the movies. Go to the movies. Uh, I don't go to the movies. I don't go to the movies. Visit friends, right? Visit friends. Can you help me, please? Uh, Carolina? Uh, Jesus don't... Does, she doesn't, doesn't, she doesn't, uh, mm -hmm. she doesn't, this is friends. Excellent, very good, you see, negative. Now let's make questions. Let's make questions, right? Do you, in this case, do you exercise? Do you listen to music? Does she, do they, etc., etc., right? Now. Let's start with um, Marcela, please. Exercise. Do you exercise? Excellent. Also, Ernesto, listen to music. Do you listen to music? Good. Play football. Uh, Marlon? Um, quiero ver. Play football. Do you play football today? Excellent. Excellent. Mm, maybe. Go out for dinner. Maybe. Go out for dinner. Do you go out for dinner? Do you go out for dinner? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Thank you. Otmar. Ya le funciona el micrófono, Otmar. Solo hágale así. Escucha. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Okay. Go dancing. Do you go, do you go dancing? Do you go dancing? Uh -huh, very good. Uh, Saul, take a nap. Yancy, take a nap. Manda. Take a nap. In question. Um. Do you? Do you? Uh, Take a nap. Tomar la siesta. Take a nap. Do you take a nap? Do you take a nap? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> bueno, se nos acabó la... La cora, se nos acabó la peseta, así que ni modo, ¿verdad? Vamos a dejar esto para mañana. Igual, miren, aquí podemos hacer preguntas, ¿ven? Para mañana. Y todavía nos quedó, miren. Nos quedaron varios ejercicios ahí. Bueno, será hasta mañana, ¿verdad? Eh, ya les tomé la asistencia. Este día me quedaría con, vamos a ver... Rosu está de oyente, entonces sería Carolina. Carolina puede quedarse 10 minutos extra. Bueno, 9, porque ya nos pasamos, ¿verdad? Ok. No, no problem. No problem. Good. Good. Ok, everybody. Have a good night. God bless you. See you tomorrow. Bye bye, teacher. See you. Good night. 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 No se vaya a desconectar, eh, Caro. Bye, bye. Bye, good night. bye, take care, Marlon. Goodbye. God bless you. 
Okay. Hello, Carolina. I don't know if you have questions. ¿Tiene alguna pregunta de algún tema que no haya entendido? Que le gustaría... mm, creo que como me quiero ver, me ausenté eh, con el con hacer las preguntas para el do y el das. Ah, Pero okay. lo que estamos reforzando, entonces ¿Sí? creo que ahorita eso, eso me ha ayudado un montón, porque así me perdí, me perdí esa clase. Sí, sí, eh, pero si gusta, vemos, vemos algunos ejemplos. Eh, recuérdese, Carolina, que, que en inglés se utiliza el auxiliar do y does para el presente simple, y es algo así como que obligación, ¿verdad? Obligation, eso, obligation, yes. Ok, entonces, por acá, yes. Aquí solo lo que tiene que aprenderse de memoria usted es qué auxiliar utilizamos en los siguientes sujetos. I, you, you. we, they, right? They. Y uh -huh. algunos plurales como eh, the doctors, por ejemplo. Uh -huh. Cuando es plural, ¿verdad? Ahí vamos uh -huh. a usar siempre el do. The, ok. Y el do se usa para preguntas y oraciones negativas, ¿sí? Y con el das es con el, el she, he, e it, ¿verdad? Y the doctor, por ejemplo, en singular. Como primera persona, digamos. No, como de, tercera como persona. Tercera, persona. No, tercera no, perdón. Tercera ajá, persona, sí, tercera. singular, singular. Tercera persona singular, siempre usamos el singular. das. Ok, y entonces comenzamos a hacer preguntas. Do, do I... Regáleme cualquier verbo, Carolina. Do I? Eh, do I eh, dancing? Do I dance? Dance, uh -huh. ajá. Porque no le agregamos nada más. Dancing, dancing. Okay. No dance. dance. Do I dance? Bailo. Uh -huh. Y como estoy preguntando si yo soy. Yes, ¿no? I do. No, yes, you do. Ah, uh, yes, you do. Yes, you do. O. Not. To do. You don't. You don't. Ok. Es negativo, ¿verdad? Uno es negativo, otro okay. positivo. Eh, con el you. No, you don't. Do you play football? Mm -hmm. uh, what is the answer? Yes. Do. Yes, I. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. O. Oh. No, no, you know. No, I don't. don't. Perdón. No, don't. I don't. No, I don't. Perdón. No, I don't. No problem. No, I don't. Okay. With we. Do we uh, eat pupusas? Mm -hmm. Do we eat pupusas? Yes, are. Yes. Do? Como sería nosotros, la, la, la respuesta sería ustedes. Ah, okay. Yes, you, you do. do. Oh, no. No. You? You do, don't. You don't, right? Mm -hmm. No, you don't. Mm -hmm. eh, con they. Do they... ¿Otro verbo? Um, music. Música. Do you listen to music? Listen music. Uh -huh. Listen to music. Listen to music. Yes. Yes. Eh, are. Ahí sí. O es sigue siendo day, you. Day. 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 Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Yes, day. Day. Do. Mm -hmm. O oh, no. No. They don't. Excellent. Right. Ahora vamos con tercera persona. Ah, the doctor, digamos. Okay. Do the doctors eh, operate people? ¿Abren a las personas los doctores? <ríe> sí, ¿verdad? Yeah. Uh -huh. Ahí sería yeah. yes. Eh, they do. They, they do. They do. Uh -huh. And no. no, they don't. They don't. Mm -hmm. Yes, they do. No, they don't. Mm -hmm. Ahora, con tercera persona, borremos todo esto. Tercera persona. Okay. 
Pero sí lo entiende ahí, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Ahora uh -huh. con tercera persona. Does she, she does doesn't. eat chicken? Yes. Yes. I. No, she. No, she. Ah, perdón. Yes, she doesn't. No, yes, she does. Yes, she does. Okay. And no, she. She da doesn't. Okay. Does he. Dame un verbo, Carolina. Um, work. Does he work in Ayala y Ayala? Yes. Yes. Sí. Yes, he. No, he. He. Does. No. He doesn't. Excelente oso, Carolina. <ríe> ok. Ahí estamos. Ok. Ahí está. Yo creo que lo domina. Sí, Ahí, o sea, ya. Se, se, se me pierde un poquito cuando me dice, yes, she doesn't, pero... Eh, pero es por la pronunciación, pero sí, 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 sí sé sí. que va. Que das nada más, ¿verdad? Sí. Yes. Ajá. Uh -huh. Estamos das. bien ahí, estamos bien ahí. Ok. Ok, eh, no sé si tiene otra pregunta, Carolina. Eh, pues, por el momento sentía que en esa era la que no dominaba, porque de ahí me puse con lo del abecedario, que eso, la verdad, fue bastante, no fácil, pero ¿cómo se llama? Pero sí siento que, que... ahí voy. <ríe> okay. Pero de ahí quiero ver. Creo que ahí es solamente eso, Tisho. Solamente eso. Bueno. Sí. Las recomendaciones del caso, ¿verdad? Escuche música en inglés, por favor. Vea películas de muñequitos en inglés. Eh, toda oportunidad que tenga de, de practicar su inglés, hágalo. La vez les estoy mandando videos al grupo, ¿verdad? Así que trate uh -huh. de practicarlo. No tienen que ver con el tema, pero... No, pero, pero... sí, me vi la de la, las canciones, por ejemplo, que ha estado para que escuchemos, son bien claras, porque en ocasiones uh -huh. no se entienden cuando son muy rápidas, pero sí. Uh -huh. Sí, correcto. Y eso sí. Ok. Muy bien, entonces eso sería todo, ¿verdad? Este, No sé si le han, le han parecido las clases tan difíciles, sí, super, la verdad. fáciles. O, o les... No, lo, quizás es que cuando decimos fáciles podemos decir que es fácil porque quizás sepamos algo, pero en realidad he sentido que son interactivas y eso, eso sí es lo que me ha gustado, que hay mucho como participación y creo que lo que más nos cuesta, y digo yo por mí, a mí me cuesta mucho la pronunciación, a veces sé lo que significa leerlo, pero pronunciarlo me cuesta demasiado. Sí, ahí estamos practicando bastante la pronunciación, ¿verdad? Y Duli nos ayuda, ¿verdad? <risa> Sí, también Dino. Dino. Ok, Carolina. Okay. Have a good night. Espero bueno. que tengan una feliz noche y see you tomorrow, right? Ok, have a good night. You teacher. too. Bye. Bye bye.